is what brought you together. Love is what brought all these people here. And there are people gathered here, fanning themselves, trying to stay hydrated. But all of us here are here to support you and show love as you offer your love to one another. Chapter 18, verse 22 says, He who finds a wife finds a good thing, and you found a good thing in Katie better than any of the other areas that you give yourself to with all your dedication. When all else is wrong, you have what is good. When life seems awful because we live in a world where everything and everyone will inevitably let you down, you've been given a gift from God, and that's good. After all the ups and downs that have compiled to what makes your life, we're brought here today, and you've been given a good gift. I, Andrew, in the presence of God, in the presence of God, take you, Katie, take you, Katie, to be my wife, to be my wife, to have and to hold, to have and to hold, from this day forward, from this day forward, for better, for worse, for better, or for worse, for richer, for poorer, for richer, or for poorer, in sickness and in health, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, to love and to cherish, as long as we both shall live, as long as we both shall live. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow. We were there for each other graduating college, first jobs, out of state moves. Throughout all that time, we've gone through lots of ups and downs. And I can honestly say that I've never seen you more happy. And Andrew, I think you have a lot to do with that. You guys are absolutely perfect for each other and I am so excited for you guys to begin your happily ever after. Cheers to the new bride. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. As a symbol of my vow. As a symbol of my vow. And with all that I am. And with all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I honor you. I honor you. It is my distinct and honorable pleasure to introduce to those who are gathered here for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Lucas, you may kiss. you've been waiting for, the moment they've been waiting for, your guests of honor and our newlyweds, Mr. and Mrs. Andrew and Katie Lucas. Be stubborn to go out of your way daily not to settle as a husband, to not just live with that. The same dedication or stubbornness that you show in every area of your life always use to hold on to what is good, to hold to Katie, to cherish her, to remember that she is a blessing and that you are a better man when she's beside you. My prayer and our prayer is that every day you look at her and you see this is not someone that I can live with, but it's someone that I can't live with. 